Hello, super quick one today. Uh, just an update on the Ink plugin. Uh, I haven't done an update in a couple of weeks. Work's been super busy, but um, I've gotten this one out. Oops. Oops. Uh, sorry, I had the YouTube video open and it started playing in the background and with the sound. So, okay, uh, let's get to it. So this is Obsidian. This is showing my other plugin here. But um, if you update to 0 0.2.3, um, so you'll see in community plugins, I am at 0 0.2.3. You have to do that through Brat at the moment, but um, in the future it'll be a real release, so you, it'll it'll just update to that. Um, what if you go to if you restart after you update? I guess usually um, if you go to the ink settings, you'll notice there is now uh, a customize file organization. Now, if you leave that off, then by default it's going to follow your files and links specification here so um, in obsidian settings default location for new attachment attachments is in the folder specified below for me um, and I've specified files slash other um, so if I close this and go into files you'll see I've got canvases drawings drawings are actually from Excala draw I should probably change that name um, and then in other is where all my other things go. So images, things like that, uh, videos, you can see a GIF there, a WebP image file. And then so inside that is where my um, ink file folder has been going. Um, that's not where I want it um, because of the way I wanna, because I wanna store any file I haven't classified in a specific folder into the other folder, my Obsidian folder, my Obsidian attachment folder is gonna stay as other. But I want my ink folder to come out. So what I'm gonna have to do, and your setup will be slightly different, so you can figure this out for yourself, but in ink, what I'm gonna have to do is go customize file organization, and it gives me a few extra settings. So now it says use Obsidian's default location for attachments is on. That's on by default. And it's going to put writing files into a subfolder called ink slash writing and drawing files into the subfolder ink slash drawing. So that's what it's doing at the moment uh, because I've said customize, but I haven't actually customized it yet. Um, so... So I'm just getting my other pane up. So um, if I leave it like this, it's still going to use the default location for attachments before using these subfolders. So it's going to land in the other folder, then the ink folder, then the writing folder. So I actually want to turn this off. And if I want it to land directly in the files folder, I need to put a files slash in front of this. Now you can do this wherever you like, um, but that's what mine's gonna do. You can also leave it to go into whatever your Obsidian default attachment folder is, plus any subfolders. If you don't want the ink folder, you just want it to be writing, just delete that section, but I wanna keep mine. So let's just for argument's sake, make this um, hello and this goodbye. And I'll close that and you can see inside files, those folders don't exist. But if I create a new file, not that way, um, let's get back one, I'll create it here and I'll say insert a writing section and you can see immediately the folder hello has appeared inside the files folder with my writing thing and insert drawing section and now we've got goodbye in there. Now that's not actually what I want. What I want is to have that ink slash writing and ink slash drawing. So if you want a different, if you want subfolders, just add another slash in. That's it. Um, 
hopefully that helps people. I know uh, there are a few people posting about it in the issues section wanting this capability. I'm not super happy with the user experience here. I don't think it's as clear as, as it should be what's happening, but um, I think it works for now um, and I'll improve it over time. So um, hopefully that helps some people and thanks for everyone who posted in that issues section to um, get me to do it. Thanks a lot. Have a good day, guys.